You know what? I thought that when I initially made a video on this man, I thought it would be the last time that I'd ever make a video on this man. Because I, I thought that, you know, shit couldn't get any worse. Shit couldn't get any weirder and that he couldn't cuck himself anymore. That's right. If you heard the word cuck, no, we're not talking about Sneeko. No, 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 no. That ship sailed. That ship's way past. We're here. We're back talking about Adam 22. That's right. The cuck lord himself, the world's biggest cuck, is back at it again. And just when you thought that shit couldn't get any worse than it did last time where, you know, after him and his wife, Lena the Plug, decided to get married. God knows why. Um... And not long after they got married, Lena decided to post a video of her getting her back, black, her back blown out by some big black man. Um, which is just, you know, cuck lord stuff. And according to the guy who, you know, plowed Lena's back, um, apparently Adam22 was the one filming it. Which just makes shit even worse. But, like I said, I thought, it, I thought that we were done with this shit. I thought that, like, you know... We, it couldn't get it, could, it couldn't go any, go any further nothing else could happen but what the fuck comes along a fucking reality tv show well a reality web series show actually basically the premise of the tv show and i'm going to show the trailer of it in a second um for some reason it's in portrait form i can't find it in landscape so yeah but premise of the tv show is that there's a whole bunch of men on this show, and then whichever one wins the reality TV show, I don't know how they determine that, I guess she's just gonna pick, um, gets to plow his wife. Just... Uh, I'm fucking speechless. Here's, here's the... Here's the fucking video. Hey, I'm Lena the Plug, I am an adult creator. My name is Adam22, and I co-own Plug Talk with my lovely wife. We interview a different girl every week. And then we f*** them at the end. But we've only ever done it with other women. So we've arranged this whole challenge to find the perfect guy to be our first ever boy-boy-girl threesome. Cheers! Lena, I came ready to f*** Do you want to do a dance-off? Oh yeah, I would love to see a dance-off. <laughs> Let well, me get in the room with her by herself. You wanna get out? No, no, no. Get out. Wait, we're, gonna, right? we're gonna get you out of the situation. Take us so long to get this <laughs> approved on YouTube. <laughs> I I'm just I'm speechless. I really am. I'm just uh, I'm I'm absolutely fucking speechless. I mean, this is just bringing the whole cuck shit to a new fucking level. Like, god fucking damn. Ho holy f Like, listen, it's bad enough though, like, they already have infidelity in the relationship, you know, with the whole, you know, thing about the big, the, the dude that she fucked and then apparently they have sex with some other girl on the, some podcast. Which, you know, it doesn't really fucking matter if they have an extra guy or a girl. It's still fucking stupid. And then the fact that, you know, they're bringing in a guy and they're doing a whole reality show wrapped around it. And even if, uh, you, like, if this was anyone else, I would 100% be like, this is a joke. Like, it's 100% a joke. It's just taking the piss. Like, it's not actually going to happen. But you know, you fucking know with it being Adam-22... And his wife, Lena. You 100% know that this shit's legit. Of course it fucking is. Because she plows other dudes anyway. She keeps making adult content despite them actually getting married. And, you know, they, she, they've obviously bring in other girls as well. So she's just like, well, we bring in other girls in these threesomes. Well, where's my turn to get my back blown out, you know? Let me bring some dudes. And, uh, you know, obviously... <sighs> this reality show is fucked. I can't believe that, like, Adam let that dude speak to him when, you know, this whole reality show is wrapped around his wife. It's just like, like, not only are you gonna, like, is he in contestant to fuck your wife, but then you're also letting him speak to you like you're a piece of shit, and then you're taking it like the cuck that you fucking are. Um, one comment that I saw was really funny is that someone said that, um, Sneeko should be brought on for season two. Um, I, I definitely think that should be a thing. Um, 
Adam 22 gets Nico on for season two, um, where, you know, they try to, a whole load of contestants try to fuck his current girlfriend if he has one, because he would definitely be down for something like that. The only thing, the only difference between Adam 22 and Lena the Plug is that Adam would probably get involved with it, where Sneeko would just like to hide in the dark corner in, in the chair. So I think that would be the only minor difference when it comes to this reality TV show. But th this is like, this is actually a joke. And the fact that they even said, like, it's going to take a while to get approved on YouTube. I hope it fucking doesn't. I mean, it probably will. But, God, they do not deserve any type of fucking spotlight on the platform. Oh, man. God damn. It, it was a sl- It was a sl- Listen, man. This is a... I was like, when I flicked on Twitter today, man, I was really hoping to find something interesting like the last couple times that I've made videos. You know, I made video about AOT. I made video about, you know, the Boogie documentary, with I, which I found really interesting. And then today when I was like flicking through things to try and find to talk about, there was really not much that I could really find. And then the only thing that I came across, <coughs> my check on that one, my check, my check. <coughs> the only thing I can manage to come across was Adam fucking 22 and... God damn, but I, I knew when I saw this, I was just like, oh my God, just like, uh, just, uh, I, uh, just, I have to. <laughs> I was just like, there's nothing else interesting to talk about today. I just, I got, I got to, I got to make a video on this because God damn, it's just, it's baffling my fucking brain about how, how low this man is stooping. And if you've defended him before, I even saw like a post where someone was just like, I've like, you know, in the past, like kind of defended him. That's what people have said. Like, oh yeah, I found it funny in the past and all that shit. But even they're like, this is just a new low, bro. Like it really fucking is, man. Like if you want to do shit like this as well, do it behind closed doors. Don't put it on the internet for people to see. No one wants to see your shit. No one wants to see what you do in the bedroom. Honestly, if you want to be a cock lord, be it in private. If you're doing it in private, then that's fine, bro. That, you know what? That's fine. That's absolutely fine. You want to bring other dudes to plow your wife in private where no one else sees and no one else knows about it. If that's your thing, then that's fine. Don't bring it onto the fucking internet, man. The fuck? Like, like honestly, she could just keep creating like s some kind of adult content. You know, maybe behind closed doors, you know, and just for her OnlyFans or whatever the fuck it is, instead of posting it all over her Twitter, you know, and then he keeps reposting about it. The fact that he keeps posting about it as well is just making him an even bigger cuck. Like, he's just in on it all, and he's just fucking riding that train, man. But yeah, that's it for me, guys. Uh, let me know what you think about this whole entire situation down below. But yeah, that's it for me. Peace out.